I thought I'd just show you what the inside of the floor looks like. So we took off the linoleum all the way around. I just cut it, you know, all the way around underneath the carpet. Took the whole linoleum out in one piece, and when we put it back down, we can do a loose lay. But you can see why the floor was damaged. You got 30 inches. See, I added these boards here. There's 30 inches between those two bars, and there's nothing supporting the floor. It was all just the floor. And when you look at the floor, what it's made out of, oh, five millimeter thick, almost like balsa wood, although it's not, but it's certainly feels like it. It's very fragile. See, it has a glue. They glued the foam on there, but look, just this little tiny thing. It's really lightweight, very bendable. Which is fine, except that you can't have a 30 inch, 30 inch by, you know, three foot section with nothing supporting it. So even this, they got this ducting work here and they put some stuff around there, but it's just floating out here on its own. I'm guessing this whole section here is just going to not have anything. So I'm just going to box it out like this all the way across and it's already feeling way better. I need special care to get underneath to where the edging is half on, half off, or partially on at least, some sort of grab. So that way you don't feel the difference in the ledge when you walk on it. So I'm going to do all the way to the entrance. But that's about half. That's about half done right now. All right, let's start with Journey's bed. It's kind of packed because it's travel day, but you can see we've got some bungees on her drawers. She's filled it all up with her stuff, so now she has her area. I had to put a transition strip on the bathroom and on the floor, but you can see the floor turned out good. It's got a little bit of new trim around. Can't really see where it's where the new floor is and where the old floor is, which is what I was going for. There's a all the way around this side. Did that. My oven, I painted. I painted it. Don't forget we fixed the couch. Oh yeah, the couch got fixed. Didn't do the cushion jet, but we got these new gussets my mother-in-law helped me come up with. You can see this little piece here that old ones are all flopped over and they stuck up too far, so I made new ones that are better. She sewed up this wonderful fabric around it. Very good work. Uh, even kept the covered buttons on it. This part of the table was broke right here, so it got fixed. Anything else that I fix in here? I feel like I fixed so much that I can't remember. Oh, the couch. Miles mentioned the couch. Our couch was really sad, so oh, you don't. Got, there's no way the camera's gonna see that. Just, it's fine. The couch is. The couch is fixed. Yeah, it's way better. You can see like over here, no threshold, I just had to pull the carpet back. Just yeah, like a quarter inch, but I can't really tell. Got more trim here. This was all really custom. I had to go around this corner here. You can see. Tricky. So that's the floor project. All finished finally. 